Welcome to the Windows channel and um, this is a little update concerning the use of a third-party antivirus. Um, a lot of you use other antiviruses than what is the default in Windows. Uh, that includes, you know, the Windows Defender or security, security Essentials, depending on the version of Windows you are. Now, there's one thing that you got to understand. So, of course, yesterday was Patch Tuesday, and we did have our cumulative update for Patch Tuesday before, because we had last week, and yesterday was just minor updates. But in the case where some of you might have not noticed or not seen any antivirus, uh, antivirus, sorry, any Windows update, uh, one of the things that's happening right now is if you're using a third-party antivirus, whatever it is, um, you might not get the update right now. Even worse, one of the options that I didn't even think about is also a problem. Say you're not using an antivirus, you're not even using the basic security from Microsoft. So you're on Windows 7 and you've got no antivirus at all because you don't want one. That is also causing problem right now because you're not getting that tweak of the registry key that actually is telling Windows that you're okay for future updates. Because this is all what's happening right now. If your antivirus isn't updated to uh, accept the uh, new Spectre Meltdown um, bug fix, you're also blocking yourself from future updates, which is kind of interesting here because you know, I would hope and I, I sincerely hope and I guess most of them will comply to have the compatibility and the updates will go through. But um, it's kind of a dangerous game that I find here. And uh, it all has to do with a very, very tiny thing, uh, a registry key that is changed. So what's happening is that if you're getting cumulative updates for security, it means that your antivirus has changed a or added a registry key that tells Windows, yeah, yeah, I'm okay for updates. And the registry key does say quality updates in it. Um, if that registry key isn't there, you're not getting updates. And what's scary is that you're not getting future updates as long as that key isn't there. And, you know, it kind of tells me, um, I've always, always been a big fan of not using third-party antivirus because once again, I, I, I don't believe they protect you, really. They don't protect you. What protects you is yourself. Um, every time I get a message from someone saying, hey, man, you know, uh, you shouldn't say not to use a third-party antivirus. Windows Defender is crap. I don't care. Windows Defender is not the best. I do agree. But it is still there and still a protection. And I don't really care what you think about that because... The real security is yourself. And I, I want to always stress that out to everybody. You are your own security. Um, whatever antivirus you get, you're going to be bitten by a virus, a malware of some sort, ransomware, if you're not careful. Whatever antivirus you use. Because if you rely on that for security, you got security totally wrong. You got to rely on yourself. This is the only way that your computer staying safe. And keeping updates, of course. So, you know, this kind of also brings me to the conclusion a little bit of, you know, I don't know, don't use third party antivirus. They are, for the most part, useless. For the most part, you're gonna pay for nothing. And you know what? You being careful is what's important. And, you know, you're gonna avoid things like that. You know, I'm using the Windows Defender on Windows 10 here. I'm getting the updates because it's okay, and uh, basically, um, you know, anybody that uses the basic antivirus of Microsoft is okay. And that's another add to, you know, when you have third-party software that does things, sometimes it messes up and kind of makes it a little complex on the systems. Um, but whatever you're using, if you're using a third-party antivirus, make sure that you check for updates regularly and to make sure that... Uh, the updates show up on your machine in the future. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, and thank you so much for following us on this channel.